Hey guys and welcome to the channel. This is going to be an overview on Sugarbush's Mount Ellen, known for its tree skiing, mellow terrain, and park. I'm going to share with you my experience of the mountain, what I think it's good for, and why you should or shouldn't visit this side of Sugarbush. Alright, so first off, we're going to do a Google Maps overview of Mount Ellen at Sugarbush so you can get visual idea of what it's like. So it's much smaller than Lincoln Peak, which is probably obvious, but what I want to get at is that you can see by the terrain here that it's a bit more mixed. So you got from my experience you have couple like medium steep sections a lot of really mellow stuff down bottom uh, mostly pretty mellow stuff and then some really steep stuff up here at the top and uh, you can see here it's got some steepness to it um, it's pretty steep at the top uh, compared to sugar bush like uh, heaven's gate and castle rock it's at least that steep it's pretty impressively steep at the top here so uh, it's got just about something for everybody but I would say it's more of a beginner mountain just on terrain alone because it's mostly greens down here I mean super flat it's got almost half the mountain is uh, from about here down and even up here is flat I mean it's pretty flat the um, Midsection in here, some trees and stuff in here. They have some medium steepness, and then there's some expert terrain, mainly at the very top. And through this middle section, it's kind of steep, but it's definitely more of a blue square type of mountain. It's uh, for generally, I'd say it's more for your beginner skiers, with um, uh, but it has something for everybody. If you want to just, you know, cruise some groomers and take some easy terrain, occasionally hit the hard stuff, Mount Allen's great. Now, comparing it to Sugarbush, well, obviously it's a lot smaller, but it's uh, it's got a lot less pitch than, than uh, Lincoln Peak, right? So Lincoln Peak, you can see Castle Rock is steep, um, Heaven's Gate, it's all steep comparatively right much steeper um much less steep here and you can see where the fall line kind of ends and you can see it's only about up here where it's real steep and uh sugar bush definitely has a lot more expert terrain this place is a bit more varied mainly on the beginner side and good for park so this bottom slope is perfect for park, and they have an awesome park here, uh, which I'll get to. And uh, so if you want to just lap something easy or take some beginners, come to Mount Ellen. If you want more expert terrain or bigger variety, go to Lincoln Peak, the main part of Sugarbush. All right, so here's a clip of about mid-mountain. You can see that it's pretty mellow, not very steep. And up ahead, you see the steep section, which is pretty steep, but short and mellows out right away. So here's a short clip of what some of the steeper stuff at Mount Ellen looks like. This is about some of their side country. And you can see it's pretty much just mellow trees and nice mellow slope. Perfect for an intermediate or someone that just wants to have a chill day. Um, or might somebody that might want to find some of the leftover snow. There are a lot of good trees in Mount Ellen and a lot of really mellow, fun terrain. So it's really good for just about anybody, uh, especially if you're going there with a family or something. Mount Ellen's going to be the best place, so that way uh, the beginners can have a great place to ski. You can take a couple runs uh, in the trees or on something steeper if you feel like and hopefully miss some of the lines. Um, and one more thing is that if you like park, which is gonna be the next section, Mount Ellen is absolutely the place for park. 
There's uh, a little bit of everything at Mount Allen, which is what I really like about it. There's some steep stuff, a little bit gnarly stuff, a lot of mellow stuff, some good trees. So I'm going to leave it there, and we're going to pick up the next section with my review of the park. So if you're looking to hit some park in Vermont, my personal opinion, I'd say that the main park on Mount Allen is one of the best parks in Vermont. It's just jam-packed with features. It's very creative. Uh, all the features and lips and everything are very well maintained, and there's tons and tons of variety and progression. What really separates this park from others is the flow, how all the features flow together, and you can just hit so many features in a row, and the creativity. There's so many features here that I've never seen anywhere else, combinations, with uh, single features or just lines and groups of features that there's really always something new to hit when you come to Sugarbush Parks. It's really never the same anytime you go there. The park is definitely tailored more so to advanced riders, but there is a lot of progression here and some easier parks. There's some medium-sized jumps here, 10, 20, 30 footers, but nothing too crazy. It's definitely more of a rail style park. So I hope this review really helped you and this is my opinion of Sugarbush Parks. So with that I'm going to end the video there. If there's any other mountains you'd like to see me review please drop them in the comments below and if this video helped you please share your experience and uh, if you want me to make some more videos uh, please drop a like, comment, and subscribe and with that uh, have a good trip and catch you guys out there.